Let me see you. <laughs> wow. This is awesome. <laughs> Are we supposed to do that yet? I think it's cool. <laughs> Wow. Nelson, two years ago, I made the best decision of my life by responding to a message on Hinge from a man whose profile picture consisted of him with a handlebar mustache and a WWF championship belt. After our first date, with the questions you asked, the way you listened when I spoke, and all the things we realized we had in common, I knew you were special and someone I wanted to know more. Sarah, the first thing I want to do is say I love you. I knew very early on that you were the person that I wanted to spend the rest of my life with. Whether we are lounging down in the basement with Bud, going on a hike, or running to Hobby Lobby for the second time in a week, <laughs> it is more enjoyable because I am with you. I feel like the luckiest woman in the world, and I know that God made you for me. You're the hardworking, family-oriented, sports-loving man that I've been praying for my whole life. You make me happier than I could ever imagine, and more loved than I ever thought was possible. I promise to walk hand in hand beside you through whatever our lives may bring, in sickness and in health, and in failure and in triumph. You're my best friend, my one true love, my everything and beyond. I oh. love you. <laughs> I am truly a lucky man to be able to call you my wife. On our wedding day, I want to make some promises to you as your husband. I promise to be there for you in the highest of highs and lowest of lows. I promise to always provide for you and our family to be the rock you can depend on. I promise to be a dependable partner and a future father. I promise to try and make you happy each and every day for the rest of our lives. And I promise to always love you. I love you for you and wish everyone could have a Sarah in their life. All you want to do is nurture all of those around you. And at the end of the day, you just want everyone to love each other and be friends. And it's just the simplest thing. To be frank with you, loving you is one of the easiest things I've ever done. <laughs> and now you have Nelson, someone who will never, ever stop loving you. Nelson, I can't ever thank you enough for what you've done to Sarah. Sports are our life. While we know you love them, be prepared to be inhaled by them. It's what we do, it's what we love. To the only person I know who religiously wears AYSO practice jerseys over the age of, I don't know, 30, 25, congrats, you officially married into this. It's nothing like I've ever experienced. Sarah's starting to talk about this guy, Nelson. I don't know if they met on Tinder, or if they were in Safeway and they both reached for a dozen eggs, or when Sarah talked about Nelson. I mean, that's the happiest I had seen her since she got a cell phone. And so, and actually after today, I think they're pretty serious about each other. It's nothing like I've ever experienced.
you know, Nelson's really someone that I look up to and, and a lot of people look up to as well. Has a lot of qualities that I aspire to have. And for Sarah, from the third most recent addition to the family to the newest, welcome to the family and cheers. I just appreciate everybody coming out here. Uh, I, I think it's, it's a great opportunity to celebrate. Nothing but the best to you folks. I wish you well and I love you both.